Getting your house ready for the winter, there are things that you can do right now to make sure that there are no problems later in the season. News 2's Riley Benson speaks with safety experts about what you should expect. Home fires are by far the disaster that we respond to the most. I mean, on average, we respond to six home fires uh, a day here across the state. Benjamin Wilson, who is a communications specialist with the American Red Cross, says they are already seeing an uptick in home fires this holiday season. In the past seven days, um, we've responded to nearly 25 home fires across the state and helped 70, 74 people. The American Red Cross says that there are simple steps to take in your home, including cleaning your chimney and making sure that you aren't leaving your Christmas tree lights on or candles burning. As you get to the point where you're, you're trying to maybe turn on the heat for the first time, maybe using the fireplace, maybe using a space heater, lighting candles, all of those things are fire hazards that can increase your chance of having a home fire. Williamson says the best thing you can do is to plan and prepare for a fire in your home. Practice a plan with your family, your kids as well. Make sure you can get out of the house in under two minutes. Make sure you can get out of each room in the house at least two different ways. Williamson says one of the most important prevention tools to protect yourself against a home fire is to make sure you have working smoke detectors in your house. Uh, we encourage folks, smoke alarms is the most important thing. We have a program where we install those for free. So if you need them, contact us and we can come out and get you hooked up with those. You can visit redcross.org or getasmokealarm.org to sign up for free smoke alarms through the American Red Cross. Williamson says they will come out and install those at no charge. Reporting in North Charleston, Riley Benson, Come on 2.